Hey everybody, it's Crappy here. Hope everybody's doing well out there. Sorry I haven't made a video in a while. I uh, got a little perturbed. YouTube sent me an a email denying monetization of my channel. We can't, Mr. Casper, we can't explain um, why you're just not going to get paid. <laughs> Dang, man. Come on. He could do better than that. At least say, if you do this and this and this, but they didn't. So anyway, I made a couple changes. I might try again, but what are we talking about? 100 to 50 bucks a month or something? Who knows? Um, it's not. A, it's just the principle of the thing. You do all this work and then you expect to get something and you don't get anything. Oh well, I guess I am crappy because I can't even get monetized. All right. Well, I have not been playing the casinos much lately. I've been concentrating on working and stuff, but um, I've been playing online and I've been playing an Iron Cross version with my tower strategy. Every time I hit a field number, I pile it up on the eight and collect it out. It's been working pretty good. I, I'd say I'm winning, I don't know, I'm up a couple hundred bucks and I don't play, you know, I'm only playing at the dollar level. So I'm not doing too bad. And right now I had a hundred in there and I'm down to 70, so I'm down a little bit. So I quit and I'm gonna go back and play it again. But I thought I would share this strategy. You can play it at any level. I'm not a huge Iron Cross, Cross fan, but this seems to give you lots of ways to make a big tower. So anyway, uh, I'm not gonna play the pass or don't. You guys know I usually don't. If you play the pass line, 10's the point, you get paid one to one unless you throw odds on it. So I'm, I just don't do it, okay? I keep out of that unless I'm the shooter and we'll just assume that someone else is shooting. All right, let's get a come out and I'll show you what I'm talking about here. We're gonna do it at the $25 level. I got $1,100 bankroll enough for about 10 shooters. Say so you can do it at $10 level. There's a seven, 15, five, whatever, you, whatever. Snake eyes, we get a point. And we got a six for a point. All right, so $115 per shooter to play this. All right, now here's what I do. I pile everything on the eight that I win. Every, every time I hit a field number. Anytime I hit one of these numbers, I throw my five dollars on the five so that leaves only the six where you'll you don't get paid a lot and that kind of seems to help this iron cross work out you'll see as we progress all right here we go and we got snake eyes look at that pays us double in the field 60 bucks all right i'm gonna split these off because it'd be easier for me to stack them okay and the reason I got $30 field is because it works out with the eight. It always makes my numbers work out. So whatever strategy, whatever you, denomination you play it in, try to make the eight work out, the field work out where it pays you on the eight. All right, here we go. And we hit a 10 the hard way. It's gonna pay us 30 bucks. Pile it up on the eight. Now, just like that, we got $120 eight. And we hit the eight, $120. We're gonna lose our field. So we're minus that. That does kind of hurt a little bit, but we're gonna get paid 140. 140. And now I'm gonna put my field back, put my eight back down to 30. And that leaves me at 175 $200 profit. Not too bad, huh? It don't always work that way, guys. Believe it or not. Believe it or not, it don't always work that way. Here we go. All right, we got a six. That's our point. All right, we're gonna lose our field, but we're gonna get paid 35. So we're gonna make $5. And we'll pile that on the five. All right, we're not going to work come outs. So everything's off. I'll pull my field down. Here we go. There is a 10. That's our point. Here we go. We 
hit snake eyes. Look at that. That's the best thing we can do. Pays us 60. Pile it up on the eight. So this is, uh, there's a six. It's going to lose the field, but we're going to get paid 35. I'm going to take that $5 and throw it on the five. And we hit the eight again. We'll lose our field. So that's a, something that you always got to take out of it. We're going to win 90 bucks. So basically we're doubling every all of our other hits is what we're doing. Um, we got 90 on there. 90 pays 105. 105, so we got to put our field back. Go back to 30. And that leaves us uh, $135, just good. All right, that pays for another shooter, that's good. All right, here we go. And we sevened out. I had a feeling that was happening. All right, we did good. Starting out ahead. All right, we are coming out. We got a craps three on to come out. Bad for the pass line, good for the donies. We got a five. All right, cost us 115 a shooter at this level to play. All right, we rolling. We got a craps three. It's gonna pay us 30. I'm gonna split those again because it makes it easier for me to stack them. A normal dealer would stack it like that. I'm gonna stack it like that for me. A lot of people like to criticize my dealing. That's their, I think that's the only reason they watch, to see when I screw up. But I'm, I've never been a dealer in my life. I just kind of learned wing this, especially when you go back to look at my videos on my green table. All right, there's a six. I'm gonna lose the field, but I'm gonna get paid 35, so it gives me five bucks. I'm gonna add that five to the five right there. And we get a nine. We'll pay us 30 bucks, piling it up on the eight. And we hit a four the hard way. It's gonna pay us 30 bucks, we'll pile it up on the eight. And we hit a five, that's our point. And we got uh, $30 on the five, that pays us 42. I'm just going to collect that. Gives me somewhere else to collect, huh? All right. We are coming out. And I'm going to leave that five up. I'm going to keep adding those um, five dollars on there whenever I hit one of those. So there's a six. That's our point. All right. Here we go. We're rolling. And we hit a nine, that pays us 30 bucks. Piling it up, look at that. That's a nice size pile right there, ain't it? And we hit a six. That's our point. We're gonna lose our field. We're gonna get paid 35. We're gonna add that to our five. Here we go. And we get a craps three on the come out. Oops, that wasn't supposed to be out there on the come out. I would have won if it was, right? Eight. They would have paid me, even though I made a mistake. All right, we need that eight before we need that other number. Here we go. And we get a four. We are building up that tower. The, the advantage to place bets, because we won 30, piled it up there. You could pull those down at any time. I mean, you could clean that up right now. That would be a sweet deal, but I'm going to shoot for that eight. I might regret it after this roll right here. Here we go. Ooh. And we get a craps three. We are continued to build. All right. Look how fast that tower grows. And we 
get a six. We're gonna lose the field, we're gonna get paid 35. Here I go, building up that five. Come on now. Come on now. Be good to me. We hit a 10 on the end and we're still building up that tower. Ooh, I ain't got, do I got the guts to continue? When it gets so big like that, do you just take it on home with you? Whew. If we was down, I probably would. I'm gonna leave it up there. Here we go, we're going for that eight. And we hit it. Wouldn't that would have been sad if I'd have pulled it down? All right, we're gonna lose in the field. One, two, three, four, five. 4 so we got 230 dollars pays 280 is that correct 240 pays 280 1 2 75 80 $280. All right, we're gonna go to 30, back on our field, 30 back on our eight, and we're gonna make $450, $60 in profit on that one hit. That's what I'm saying if you end up getting down, which can't, will happen, I'm gonna have to get another rack up in here. Guys, look at that. Um, if you end up getting down, not to say it will every time, but a couple good hits, man, and you can come back. You know what I'm saying? So I would just stick with it. All right. We are doing great at this point. It ain't going to do that every time. Don't ever say, I told you, this will work every time. It's working this time. Seven on the come out. My field was not supposed to be out there. Y'all know that. Alright, and we get an eight. Alright, let's get back in it. Here we go. And we seven ouched. Alright. Our rack is looking really big. Our bank over here is looking kind of thin. <laughs> That's what I like. Now, one time I was in, um, Biloxi and uh, sometimes I play all night long and I know that ain't the way I usually play but I just played all night I mean I had a good shooter there it was me and one other guy and we had won all the black chips they had on the table he did I had all the green chips and a bunch of black I think I won like four grand that night and he, the other guy I don't know the 20,000 marks but he was betting black chips we cleaned them out and for some reason that late at night they don't let them put more chips up there so they had to buy our chips back to keep the game going so we had to color up in the middle of the game all right that was a great night and that was playing the tower strategy just saying all right here we go come in out six all right we need a 115. Let's see what we can do with this guy. Come on now. And we hit a five. All right, we're gonna lose our field. We're gonna make five bucks. Just gonna stick that on the five. Keep building that five up. And we set it out. Now the depletion. That is tough when that happens. All right, we are coming out. We got enough time for one, maybe two more shooters. There's a three on the come out, can't set a point. There we go, there's a six. All right. 115 to buy in. All right, here we 
go. And there is a craps three. That pays me 30. All right, here we go. And there's the eight. We got the eight with uh, 60 on the eight. And that pays 70. We'll lose our field. We're gonna put our field back up again. And I'm gonna knock this back down to 30. All right, we took one little hit there. And we hit the eight again. That ain't gonna do much for us. All right. That's going to lose the field. We're going to win this. I'm going to add that $5 to the eight. Let me to the five. And we hit the five. There's the three. All right, 30 on the five is going to be 42. shooters here we go coming out we got a six the hard way as you guys seen one good shooter can bring you back so don't don't give up there's no guarantees this is a um, high risk I mean you got to think there's six ways to hit that number we don't talk about and only five ways to hit that. So it throws the odds in their favor. But what we're risking is doubling up everything that we've hit. But at any time, you can pull that down. It makes you feel sad though, when you hit an eight the next row after you pull it down. And we hit a six, that's our point. I'm gonna lose our field, gonna get paid 35. I'm gonna add that $5 to the five. All right, here we go. And we going back to the six. That field wasn't supposed to be out there. I should I should have took it down. Not working on coming out. So anytime I leave my field out there, it's just by mistake. Lord knows people love to find my mistakes. You need to pay yourself on that cheek, right? You you crappy. You terrible crappy. Uh, you should see read go through and read some of the comments. Yes, I make a shitload of mistakes. Not perfect. I'm not even a dealer. I think I prove that every day, right? All right, there's a nine. It's going to pay us 30. Put that on the eight. And we seven out. Oh, dreadful, dreadful, dreadful. Just was getting it going. All right, guys, should we try one more shooter? We're at 19 minutes. I'm in the profit. Gonna knock my profit down if I don't hit on this one, but let's try it. All right, you go with 11 on to come out. 10 on the end, the hard way. All right, risking 115 again. Here we go. We rolling. And we hit the 10, that's our point. Not before we get 30 bucks though. And we got a $60 eight. And I'm pulling, I remember pulling my field down this time. Well, I'll come out smoke, it won't be out there, all right? There's a yo, if I would've won it though, wouldn't that be cool? And there's a four, going to the other side. 
All right, let's get her going. There's a five, five diva five. We're gonna pay us 35. We're gonna lose our field, but we're gonna put it back and add five on there. And we hit a six. Same difference. Lose here, get paid 35. Add that five dollars on the on the five. And we hit the eight. Sixty dollar eight pays seventy bucks. Lose the field. With that field, you don't do terribly great. I'm gonna leave thirty up there. Thirty here. Collect this. So Really, we made like 50 bucks, 60 bucks. All right, here we go. We're rolling. And we get an eight again. That don't do much for us. Pays us $35, we lose this, get paid 35. I'm just gonna keep building that five up. And we hit the four the hard way. That's our point. Pays us 30 bucks. the eight and we are coming out let me pull my field down so nobody yells at me in on the end all right here we go and we hit a nine pays us 30 bucks in the field all right here we go and we get another nine don't take long to build it up like this, does it? We're at 120 now on that eight. And we sevened out. Mm. Never collected. Well, we did collect one, didn't we? Small one. Took a loss on that shooter. All right, we are in overtime at 22 minutes. We started with 1100 bucks. And this is our profit here. Three hundred. Twenty-five. Twenty-six. Twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. Three hundred and twenty-nine dollars in profit. Um, I'd say this is got a, a substantial risk to it, but as you've seen. You're waiting on that one good where you tower up big. Remember we hit that one for 400 bucks. You know, that's that's what you're looking for. And you're doubling up all your winnings off the field. And that adding the extra money to the five seems to help too. Because what's that five dollars gonna do? We would have an extra, what, 30, 40 bucks in here. That's about it. But meanwhile, it's paying us and added to this. So I would, I would have enough bankroll for 10 shooters, whatever level you're playing it at. Um, if you play below this level, you're not really going to be able to add a unit to the five. So that's the only disadvantage. I like it, guys. I like it. I've been playing at the dollar level. And um, after what I do there is uh, on the online, I'll, uh, after I hit it a couple times, these insides, I can just collect the change. I think it's like 20 cents you get. When I hit it three or four times, I'll add another dollar to the five. Just seems to work for those long rolls. All right, y'all. Crappy's back. And Crappy says, don't crap out. <laughs>